I realized that until you conquer the enemy in yourself, you can't deal with anyone. Hey guys, um, I feel like I say this in like every video, but I'm back. <laughs> um, it took me forever to even do a video because I just was not motivated. You ever had that feeling where you just, you're just not motivated to do nothing, like to do nothing, the gym, nothing. I just was like in a funk, but I'm slowly getting out of my funk. Um, I was reading a lot, listening to a lot of podcasts. Uh, I was reading, I was lis listening, listening to a lot of like old school interviews with like, I have a shirt on by the way, old school, school interviews from like, um, artists that I love such as like Lauren Hill. I listened to like an interview she did like a, a while ago at, um, I, I believe it was like a college or something, but yeah. And it just sparked some interest in me and YouTube again. Um, I've had a bit of a love hate, uh, relationship with the tube and I just, I didn't want to keep doing the same things that other people were doing as far as like the lock community goes, you know what I mean? Uh, we, we tend to do the same videos and it, it kind of gets mundane and then I would record a video, I would edit it and while I was going to put it up, I noticed that like two other people who you guys are following, who I follow are doing the same video and I didn't even watch their stuff or anything. I was like, why even post this? Especially if they have way more subscribers than I do like what will be the point of you know me doing that video but I'm back and I decided I have a few new uh and I also <laughs> I to get off topic a little bit uh I was w listening to an interview and the person was talking about trust and hiding uh, what you are ashamed of and whatnot. So my view, my subscriber count is now public. If you didn't notice before it was hidden, I didn't want to show it because I felt like, first of all, I was on YouTube for so long and I just have like a nice small family, which is you guys. And some people who have been here just a shorter period of time than me have skyrocketed and are like 10,000 and 20,000 and almost a million all kind of stuff and I felt like I was comparing myself to others and I really had to stop. I had to stop. So forward into this, forward into everything. Now my my number count is available. I think I have like 2005 or something like that, which I'm happy with. Um, when I, my numbers will peak is when I feel like I will get more consistent and I would do more videos that people love. And until then, we just gonna keep rocking. So let's get right into the video. Um, I'm gonna do a kind of a no makeup makeup look. Uh, I've been really loving this nowadays because my face has like kind of been breaking out maybe due to the change in season or whatever it is. If you see, that's my my little drum over there, but don't worry about it. Um, but yeah, so let's get started. Any new subscribers, so welcome. If you haven't already, please click that subscribe button. Um, and if you already subscribe, please click, click that uh, notification bell so you won't miss out when I take my little breaks. You won't, <laughs> you won't miss when I have a new video out. So I already moisturized my face and everything. I'm gonna use my NYX Born to Glow Liquid Illuminator and I'm just gonna put them on the parts where I would put my highlighter. So my YouTube name is Essence of Shea. Um, but my real name is, uh, my real name is Shayna. Boatswain 
Um, and my mom got my name from a soap opera. Uh, if you don't know what a soap opera is, it's um, where they like General Hospital and um, stuff like that. General Hospital and all my children and stuff like that. It's hard to do makeup and and talk so let's see how this video goes but you you could see a little light action already right so yeah and then I go into with a concealer kind of close to my skin tone I do want a little bit of highlight going on but I don't want excessive so I'm taking beautiful bronze by LA girl pro LA girl pro and I'm just gonna put them over, under my eyes and then any dark areas um so yeah uh she said she was obsessed with the girl on i forgot what the show was that she actually watched um she said she was obsessed with her so she named she and she liked her real the name on the show Either it was the name on the show or it was her real name, but she was obsessed with it at the time. Nobody really was named Shayna, but everybody and their mother now, unfortunately, is named Shayna. And I mean, it is what it is. I am the first of five. There is five of us. It's me, Terrell Tyrone. Anthony and Brianna, my little sister. I'm the first born Gemini, of course. <laughs> Shout out to all my Geminis, cause we kind of run the world. This day that I'm recording, uh, I think it's the 26th. This will be out on Sunday. I want it to be out on Sunday. Um, Lawrence, Lauren Hill's birthday is today. And anyone who knows me knows that I am obsessed. I'm probably going to do like a little shout out to her in the beginning of this video when I edit it. But yeah, you guys see like it's kind of like people don't know this. I'm going to take my ring finger and just blend under my eye. I was raised in the Virgin Islands, St. Croix to be exact. Um... I moved there when I was seven years old, seven or eight. Um, I kind of stayed there until about like, like what, 10th grade or something. And then um, I moved, well on and off I moved to like Virginia and Connecticut and Places like that, I moved by my aunt's house. My aunt was in the Navy, and I guess my mom could tell that I just was not... I was just not happy where I was. So, she kind of... She kind of asked me if I wanted to, like, be around my aunt, and... Now I'm just going to buff it out more with the brush she kind of asked me if I wanted to be with my aunt so I could get a different uh kind of exposure to life so I did so on a, but I always would miss my mom or something would like happen and I just wanted to come back home so yeah uh I I don't know what number this is I will put the number while I'm editing it uh I am allergic to peaches not deathly but i get like a little bit of hives and all that i'm allergic to peaches but it's not like a crazy allergy uh i get hives and i break out into like little bumps and i feel like itchy but crazy enough it does not stop me because i make a mean girl when i tell you i make a mean peach cobbler honey and I'm going to sit there and not eat it. Like, I'm blessing everybody else and I'm not going to eat it. That don't even make no sense. Do it. So, yeah, I, I still partake 
and a peach cobbler even though I know I'm not supposed to I still I still get down have you guys ever heard of microblading your eyebrows I feel like I want to do that because mine's a couple years ago like I never needed to wax my eyebrows but I was like in the trend and I saw like everybody doing it so I wanted to do it note to self never follow everybody else note to the young generation just do your thing on your own you don't need to like to follow what's I guess trending um but yeah uh I'm I the lady waxed my eyebrows and she waxed them too thin so I've been for years now have been kind of like growing them back and I feel like they're not growing back to the thickness that they used to be. So I feel like I want to do microblading but I heard that it only lasts like a year and then you gotta go do it again like I personally ain't got no time for that personally speaking um so I'm going to highlight I know this is supposed to be like a no makeup look but it's summertime and I like to I like to glisten in the in in the sun so I'm gonna take my black radiance uh, contour palette in medium to dark and I'm just gonna take the uh, the highlighted shade oh, if you get and just sweep it there but yeah um tell me what you guys think about micro uh, microblading next thing that you guys don't know about me is that I had a video where I told you that and I showed you that I have seven tattoos but I also have five Pearson I had six um so yeah I have the two on each ear and then my nose I had my trachea pierced but the lady um she didn't she put the the uh the wrong size she put the wrong size on my um in my ear so it kind of got like infected because you know it swells up when all that is going on and it got infected and yeah I had to take that bad boy out um I told you guys I was raised in a virgin islands uh what else what else what else oh I have a huge obsession with Jay-Z a lot of people like to joke on me because of it which I don't care joke all you want baby joke all you want because let me tell you this anytime he has a concert and I could go <laughs> best believe I'm there every word I know mm-hmm that's my boy he will forever be my boy and I don't really care what anybody got to say about it how about that you know he's married to Beyonce and I don't know if I really want to hear from the beehive so I'm just gonna leave that one I'm just gonna leave that one alone but at one time he could get it I'm stupid I am deathly <laughs> transitioning I am deathly not deathly but I'm using Mac uh, shadow and desert rose blush I mean um, I am I just want to add uh, just a little bit of rosiness to my face Um, I am afraid of the dark. I don't 
guys i i know my age but and i'm not like deathly afraid like i could walk in the dark but i feel like there's always something i'm just sweeping that over my nose just trying to give myself a little bit of color um yeah so like i know that there's no reason for me to be afraid of the dark but it's just something about it just doesn't sit well with me like you can't see what's going on under all that blackness you know what i'm saying anything can kind of jump out at you so when i go to the restroom or when i go to the kitchen i need all the lights to be turned on uh if it's somebody else's house, my house, I'm fine a little bit, but I mean, it is what it is. I ain't scared. <laughs> Tell me what else you scared of. Leave comments below. Don't try to leave me out here to hang the dry. Y'all be sitting here laughing at me. Be like, Shay is afraid of the dark. She about 30 some years old. What's wrong with that girl? Leave comments below and let me know what you guys are still scared of at an adult age. Um, my favorite snack. I don't know if you guys ever tasted this or have heard about it or saw somebody eat it. But you ever slice cucumber? Me and my cousin used to do this all the time we still kind of do it but you ever slice cucumbers put it in a bowl pour vinegar over it not a lot of vinegar but to soak it a little bit and then uh kind of sprinkle black pepper mm -hmm, mm -hmm. let it sit for a while that that tangy crunchy mm, that thing tastes good honey D don't sleep on it that's some good stuff, let me tell you. That's some that's some good stuff, okay? Y'all be sleeping on some things. That's good, girl. That's good. Try it when you get home. Remember, Essence of Shea sent you. What else do you guys not know about me that I haven't quite shared? If I missed anything, guys, leave comments below and ask questions and I'll answer. You guys know on this channel, I'm an open book, honey. So go ahead, ask away. I'll tell you. That's the only way I feel like you can grow. You grow by sharing, you grow by knowing what your weaknesses are and uh, fixing them. You, It helps other people because they might be going through stuff, just sharing stuff, certain things. Nah, you don't need to know, but majority of the stuff. Hey. And for real, for real. If a person really wanted to know, they could find it out. I just added, um, I'm adding two mascaras from Maybelline. I feel like I'm done. Yeah. Um, this is my makeup look. The key is to make it seem like you have nothing on. So I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you learned a few things that you didn't know about me. Uh, if you have any requests for videos, please leave comments below because I need some I, I need some ideas so let me know. If you haven't already, please click that subscribe button. Um, also, if you haven't, please go on my Instagram page and follow the family over there. Uh, I'm fixing up my blog, so my website is below, but I'm still kind of fixing it up. So uh, it's kind of under construction at the moment. So I want more talking and more inspirational stuff over there as well and i'll see you guys next time thank you guys so much for your continuous support 
I thank you guys for watching. See you later, Tiger Lilies. Toodles.